Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are having a great day. It's Good Friday in Australia, so I wanted to get this video up because there is an exciting announcement coming very soon regarding these glitters. So obviously this is a glitter review. And a few weeks ago, I was approached by Magpie Beauty to ask if I would like to review their glitter collection. And as I don't have a regular supplier or any really decent glitters, I jumped at the chance. So I have here their original collection and I also have the spring summer collection which will be coming up in a very a video very soon. So this collection consists of 23 ultra fine cosmetic grade glitters and there's a mixture of iridescence, opaques, holographics and it is just a really gorgeous collection. So I'm going to go through each one one by one and I have them on Colourpops to show you what they look like. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so I'm just gonna run through them in no particular order and I'm gonna start off with this beautiful purple. Now this is a purple metallic. And as I said in the beginning, these are ultra fine and they are just stunning cosmetic grade glitters. So anyway, I'll push on because I have a lot of these to show you. So this one is called Margot. So the names are on the back. And I've done them over sort of the nearest colour I can to the glitter, with some exceptions. I'll show you those as we go along. So that is what Margot looks like. It's an absolutely stunning purple. So I'll just move in a bit there so you can see. So that is Margot. Okay, so the next one up is a glitter called Rosy, and as you can see, this is a beautiful rose gold opaque glitter. So the name is there. And then that is what it looks like on the Colourpop. So I have got a rose polish underneath it, a gel polish. So this is another absolutely gorgeous one. Okay, so next up is Ariel. Now this is a sort of turquoise green holographic glitter and this one is an opaque glitter. So that is what it looks like on the Colourpop and that is absolutely stunning. I really do like this one. And if you watch me regularly, you know I've got an aversion to green. So for me to like a green, it's a big deal. So absolutely beautiful. Okay, so next up we have this beautiful pale blue translucent glitter and it's an iridescent glitter. Um, and as you probably realise, this one is called Elsa. So I have done it over three colours here. So I've done it over white, I've done it over pink and I've obviously done it over the blue. So probably stay tuned. I dare say my little niece will want to see some frozen inspired nail art coming up. Okay, next up is Edie. Now this is stunning. This is a hot pink opaque glitter here and it's metallic and I've done this over a corresponding hot pink and it is just a really, really stunning metallic, this one, and I really do like that. Next up is Grace and this is a gunmetal metallic and this is what it looks like over the corresponding colour. Really lovely. Next up is Ruby, and as you can see by this, this is a beautiful red metallic. So I've done it over red, obviously, and that is what it looks like. So obviously, if you use a darker red, the Ruby will come out slightly darker. I've used a nice cherry red here. Next up is Polly. Now this is a blue-green gold multi-glitz. I did actually get that exact description off the website because I wasn't quite sure how to describe this one. So as you can see, it is mainly blue, but it has that beautiful, actually I'm just gonna see if I can zoom in a bit for you here because it really does have multicolored pieces all the way through it and it's just gorgeous, this one. So there's the name and that is what it looks like. So it's actually really pretty. I'm just gonna zoom in on the color pop a bit there for you, just focus for you. There you go. So absolutely stunning this one. Next up is Marla and this is a beautiful light pink metallic so you'd get a lovely opaque coverage with this and this is what it looks like on the Colourpop. Absolutely stunning. This one is called Willow and it is a beautiful deep green and you get a lovely opaque coverage with this so this is what it looks like over a corresponding green gel colour. So really lovely, beautiful, metallic, deep green there. This one is called Lily, and this is a white iridescent, 
and it is a translucent glitter and it has a beautiful gold shimmer running through it. So I'll just show you, I've done it over two colours here. So I've done it as white and it does have a slight pink tinge over the white and over this beautiful mint green you can really see a lovely gold coming through there. Next up is Lottie. Now this is described as a pink gold opaque and this is what it looks like over a nice pink gel. So really pretty. It's not really showing up very much gold, so it's quite a subtle hint of gold in this, and it's an absolutely gorgeous colour. Next up is one of my favourites in this collection, and this is called Patsy. So the description on the website is a purple, blue, silver, multi-glitz, opaque glitter. So I'm just going to zoom in because obviously the main colour in this is purple but as you can see there are all those other colours and it is just stunning and I will just show you what it looks like on the car pop and that is what it looks like there so a really really beautiful multi glitz glitter there okay so next up is Kate so I really do like this one and I actually don't have, obviously you can tell this is a blue metallic, it's a royal blue metallic and it's an opaque glitter. I don't have a very close corresponding colour, so I've done it over sort of a, a blue grey, but it is quite a good match as you can see there, it comes out really beautifully. So obviously one of my favourites because it's got my name. Okay, so next up we have Jess, and this is described as a coral gold, but I've actually popped it over quite a strong orange colour just to show you what you can get. So obviously in the tube it shows up as a real coral, but if you pop it over an orange, it comes out a beautiful orange colour as well. So that is Jess. Okay, next up is one of my absolute favourites. Now this is called Erin, and this is a pink holographic glitter, and it is not doing it justice on camera at all. This is absolutely stunning. This is an absolute must in my opinion, and I'll show you what it looks like over the ColourPop. So you actually get a little bit better over the ColourPop. You can see the holographic there. So I'm just gonna zoom in on that a little bit more for you. But yes, as I said, this is not coming across anywhere near as nice on camera as it is in real life. But this is an absolutely stunning colour. Next up is Goldie and this is a gold metallic. So obviously I've done it over a gold and this is what it looks like. So it's a beautiful, beautiful colour this one. Really lovely gold colour. Okay, so next up is another one of my absolute favourites, and this one is called Crystal, and it is a white multi glitz and it's an iridescent glitter. And as you can see, if I move the glitter bottle around, it has these amazing pieces of slightly larger iridescent glitter through it. So I've done it over a very pale cream, and it really shows up the larger pieces there, and I absolutely love this. And the other thing is as well, when you run your finger over it, there is no lumpiness. I've only got one top coat on that, and it is just stunning. Okay, next up we have this beautiful plum metallic, and this will give you an opaque coverage. Now, it is called Sidoni. I had to actually Google the pronunciation, and it, I tell you now, it sounds a lot better in French than it does when I say it, so apologies. So it's S-I-D-O-N-I-E and this is just gorgeous this one so that is it over a corresponding really dark plum gel polish. Absolutely gorgeous. Next up is Darcy. Now this is described on the website as a luminous orange iridescent glitter. I think it's coming across slightly pink here. It may come across orange once the film is actually up. As I am filming it though, it looks quite pink to me with a bit of gold, but I've done it over a neon orange, so it really, really does pick up the beautiful gold through this one. Next up is Sylvia. Now this is a silver metallic opaque glitter. So I've done it over a silver, and it's just gorgeous. It's a really lovely coverage, this one. Okay, so just two more to go, including this one, and this and the last one are my absolute favourites in this collection. Now this is Livy. This is a purple pink holographic opaque glitter, and again this one is nowhere near as pretty on camera as it in, is in real life. This is absolutely stunning, and this is one of the ones that I would highly recommend 
if you are only buying a few. So that is what it looks like over a colour pop. I'm just going to zoom in a little bit to see if you can see it a little bit better. No, it's just not picking up on camera as nicely, but this is absolutely stunning. Now, the lovely Sarah R has done a video as well, and I do believe that she has captured the holographic much better than my camera is. So I will link her videos below so you can also have a look at hers. Okay, so finally, the list last one is called Lola, and this is a stunning silver holographic, and again, not showing up anywhere near as nicely on camera, but this is just beautiful. So I've done it over silver again, and it does show up much nicer on the ColourPop there. Truly stunning in real life. I highly recommend this one. Okay, so this is all 23 glitters laid out for you, and they just look gorgeous. Now, as I mentioned at the beginning of the video, these are cosmetic grade and they are ultra fine and they're also UK made. Now, I will pop all of the links to Magpie Beauty below so that you can go and have a look for yourselves. She also does ship worldwide. I don't know whether there's any restrictions or not, but you'd need to check with her. Also, I should mention there is going to be coming up a very, very exciting announcement. So stay tuned. I think it will be announced UK time on Good Friday. Today is Good Friday for me, so this video will go up imminently and stay tuned for a very exciting announcement. I can't say any more, but you will find out in all due time. And guys, I hope that you like this video. If you do have any questions for me, pop them in the comments bar. As I said, I'll pop all of the product information in the description bar below. And if you haven't given a thumbs up to the video, please do. And also subscribe to my channel, guys, because I will have lots and lots of videos coming up using these beautiful glitters, as well as other nail art videos. Okay, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.